outside of it. Oh, that's our target. Nutty night, bitch. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> guys welcome back to another video now we are here with another sml movie that i don't know what the hell is gonna happen because <laughs> this one is called junior's deadly idea i wonder what kind of stupid idea junior's gonna come up with because whenever he comes up with an idea joseph is joseph agrees with him why he he can't even think this through. None of them can think this through. Only Cody did. And he thinks it's a dangerous. It he thinks it's dangerous. Whenever Junior comes up with an idea, yeah, it backfired. So I don't know what kind of stupid thing he would do in this video. So yeah. If you guys are new, make sure to drop a like and uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Anyways, let's go ahead and check out this video. So guys, what do you want to do today? Dude, something's wrong with my phone. Something, what'd you do to it? I just dropped it one or two times. One or two times? Yeah, what's wrong with it, dude? Hey, you guys, broke it. There. The news is on. Huh? I'm glad Cody's not doing the news. Okay, <laughs> the car that Tupac Shakur was shot in was sold for $1.2 million. Damn, R.I.P. Tupac. Yeah, rest in paradise, big homie. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Guys, that car sold for $1.2 million just because that guy got killed in it? The Junior, that guy is Pac. Yeah, Mr. All Eyes on Me. Yeah, double PAC, 32's up, not your shoes up, bitch. Yeah, Cody, that's <laughs> what I'm talking about. Shit, I gotta pour one out for a homie. Yeah, this one's for Pac, what? and this one's for Biggie, and this one's for XXX, and Juice World, and Nipsey Hussle, and Magnolia Shorty, and Lil Snoop. Old dirty bastard. Why are you and even pouring on water on all, all over all over the floor? Smoke, and King Von. And Young Dolph. Oh, and I can't forget Takeoff. That one hit home. And Pee Wee Herman. I mean, I know he wasn't a rapper, but damn. Oh, I'll pour this whole thing out for Pee Wee. But go, go. go get a towel and clean that up. Sorry, Junior. It's just a lot of dead homies. Oh, water everywhere. Why can't you just do it outside yeah, yeah. and you're just wasting all the water? You ain't got to tell me nothing. I lived it. I've been it. Guys, I still can't believe that car sold for over a million dollars just because Tupac died in it. Well, yeah, Junior. It's a piece of hip-hop history. Yeah, he's famous, dude. Wait a minute, guys. I just got an idea. What if we go buy a really cheap car mm. and then we get a celebrity to die in it and we can sell it for millions of dollars? <gasps> That's a genius idea! Why didn't I think of that? Junior, I think that might be the stupidest fucking thing I've ever heard you say. You're only saying that, Cody, because you didn't think of it first. No, I'm saying that because it's stupid. How is it stupid? Okay, let me walk you through it. You want us, a bunch of kids, to buy a car, which we can't afford, and then get a celebrity, who we don't know, to get in the car and then we murder them. <gasps> I never said murder. Did I say murder, Joseph? No, uh, I didn't hear murder, dude. Cody, we're not going to murder the celebrity. The celebrity is to die of natural causes. We do nothing yeah, you wrong. said that. Well, how are we going to get them to die of natural causes? We get a very old celebrity. Okay, let me go back through it again. You want us to buy a car, which we can't afford, and then get a very old celebrity we don't know to get in the car and then just hope that they die of natural causes. Yes, that's going to happen. And here's how it's going to happen. We're going to use Jeffy's car. We don't have to buy one. We can already use Jeffy's car. Okay. You're literally going to destroy you, Jeffy's car. Hey, Junior, you call me? Yeah, Jeffy, can we use your car to make millions of dollars? Sure. Just don't waste my gas. Thanks, Jeffy. Yep. See, Cody, look, we already got the car, so we're halfway through with the plan. Now we have to do the hard part of getting an old celebrity who's close to death. Let's start naming off old celebrities. Uh, You're literally gonna sell Jeffy's car? He's too smart. Michael Jordan. Oh, yeah, Michael Jordan. I mean, I guess he is old. Yeah, he's worth billions of dollars. Yeah. So if he died, then we'd get trillions of dollars. Can we even get Michael Jordan? No. Yeah. How about Dr. Phil? What, do you know Dr. Phil? No, but we could call his show and say, hey, we have a kid in our car who needs therapy, and he'll run and get in the car. Yeah, so he likes helping kids, dude. Usually the kids come to him on his show. Okay, well, it doesn't have to be an old celebrity. We can do a young celebrity. Uh, well, that's even harder, because how are they going to die of natural causes? This is what we're going to do. We're going to go find a young celebrity, put him in the car. Then we're going to go call someone that we know that hates that celebrity and say, hey, look, don't you hate this celebrity? We know where that celebrity is, so if you possibly want to kill them, they're parked right here. 
Well, Junior, now we're back to our original problem of how are we going to get a young celebrity? Okay, has any of us ever met a celebrity? Well, I met Britney Spears. <gasps> you met Britney Spears? Yeah. No, you haven't. Yes, I did. I have a poster. I'll show you. See, you guys, look. This is my poster. Okay. And she signed it. And I have this Barbie of her. So you really met her? Yeah. Do you have a picture? No, she's afraid of photos because she's afraid her soul's going to get trapped in the picture. But still, it's Britney, bitch. What? It's Britney, bitch. <laughs> it's Britney. It's Britney, bitch. Okay, so can you call Please don't go over, over that over? again. I don't know her, Junior. I'm just a fan of hers, and I definitely can't convince her to die in a car. Junior! What do you want, Dad? Shut up. I need to watch Charlie and Friends in here. My TV's broken. But, Dad, we're plotting and scheming. Look, you can plot and scheme another time. I need to watch this new episode of Charlie and Friends. <laughs> Charlie and Friends was filmed in front of a live audience. <laughs> Is he oh trying to God. spin the ball oh in his Charlie. head? It's a date. Okay. I'm gonna shoot some hoops. <laughs> that is not how you shoot hoops. <laughs> that is not how you shoot hoops. so hilarious. I hope you never die. Oh, Chef PP, come here. What do you want, Braxton? I need you to get me some chips and dip. I'm starving. Well, I don't want to get any chips and dip for you. Go and get me some chips and dip right now. God. Cody, I have an idea. Follow me to my room. Whisper this to Joseph. Okay. Uh, Joseph, Junior has an idea. Let's follow him to his room. What's up, Okay. Jenny? Okay. I officially know what celebrity we're going to have died. Charlie? Who? Oh, damn. Give me some space, Cody. Yeah, dude. Get out of space. God. Give him 50 feet. What You're close to Junior, you? Joseph. Uh, okay. Charlie from Charlie and Friends. <gasps> well, I mean, I guess that would be easy. What I say? So pretty young. How are we gonna get him to die of natural causes? So this is my foolproof plan. So you are going to call Charlie's manager and say that Charlie got nominated for an award at the Funny Awards. What are the Funny Awards? Some made-up award show that doesn't exist, but he's gonna want to go get that award. So you're gonna pull up in front of his house and say that you're his driver. He's gonna get in your car, and then Chef Peepee's going to shoot Charlie. Why would he do that? Because have you seen how my dad treats Chef Peepee when he's watching Charlie? So Chef Peepee hates Charlie because if Charlie was dead, there wouldn't be any more episodes. My dad wouldn't watch TV anymore. My dad would go get a job, and Chef Peepee would be free. That actually made sense. Yeah, so are we all in? Uh, dude, this if is like a so. proof plan. I'm really feeling it. Oh, man, I love the energy. But I don't know no, dude, if this like, will backfire really or will it succeed. So I'm out of here. I respect it, Joseph. Wait, what the hell? Can I be out, too? No, only one freak could be out, and he was out first. Wait, nobody told me that. I'm going to be out every time now. No, whoever says out first is the one who gets to be out, so now you're still in. Uh, okay, fine. Seriously? Fine. So I'm going to go convince Chef PB to get At least I'm not in it. How am I going to get his number? Just Google it. Okay, chill. <laughs> okay, yeah. If you were Chef AP and you're being treated this bad, maybe you should quit or do something bad to them. If they're just going to treat you very bad for like, I don't know how long, yeah, you got to get payback on them. How about some pee pee wiener? <laughs> I'm gonna take the chips and dip up there to him and say, Here's your pee pee wiener. He's gonna be like, What? And I'm gonna say, Oh, nothing. Walk away laughing. <laughs> you pee pee wiener eater. <laughs> He's such a freak. Shut pee pee. What do you want, Junior? I'm trying to make your dad some pee pee wiener. What? Uh, nothing. Never <laughs> walk so, do you ever hate working for my dad? Of course. You know that. That's why I'm making pee pee wiener right now. So, what if I told you if you killed Charlie from Charlie and Friends, my dad would never watch TV anymore because there would be no more episodes of Charlie and Friends, and then you would be free? That's a genius idea. Oh, my God. I should have thought of that a long time ago. But I, know, I don't know where Charlie is, Junior, so I can't kill him. He could be anywhere on this planet right now. What if I told you I know exactly where he's going to be? Wait, really? How do you know that? Because I'm a friend of a friend who's friends with him. So let me just tell you something. Charlie's going to be parked in a car that says Jeffy on the side at 2 p.m. tomorrow outside a house. Okay? Okay. So just drive by. Mm -hmm. You know, and if you want to, mm -hmm. you could possibly, you know, kill him. Okay, bet. Oh, say less. I got this. I can handle this. He's dead me. I'm not telling you to kill him. That's completely on you. Okay, I think I have the right number. Hello, this is Charlie's agent, Steve Stalberger. Oh, hey, uh, this is Jack Meehoff. Well, Mr. Meehoff, what can I do for you? Well, uh, actually, just call me Jack Off. That's what everybody else seems to do. Uh, I'm with the Funny Awards, and Charlie's been nominated for a Funny Award for being so funny. Well, he gets plenty of those. Y yeah, so uh, the award show is tomorrow at 2 p.m., so we're going to send a car over to come and get him. Okay, sounds good. I'll text you his address. Okay, thank you. 
Oh, it was really easy. Okay, that copy. was Chef PP said he's quick try there. To yeah, and I got Charlie's address. You got the address? Okay, so text the address to Chef PP so he gets the right house. Okay. And also, go pick up Charlie at 2 p.m. Well, I have to pick him up? Yes, Cody. Well, why can't you pick him up? Because I'm the brains of this operation, Cody. Does the brains go everywhere the legs go? Yes. Well, not on this body. The legs are chopped off. So you're going to go pick up Charlie at 2 p.m. Excuse me. Wear a disguise. Okay. Okay, Junior, I'm at the house. Now what? Honk your horn. Okay. Now what? Look, hang up your phone. Drivers aren't supposed to be on their phone. Okay, fine. But honk the horn one more time after you hang up. <sighs> Bossing me around. Hi, guys. I'm Charlie. I didn't expect him to do that. What's that noise I hear? Oh, it's a honk. It must be my driver. Man, he's driving me crazy. <laughs> Who the hell is he talking to? That's a good, is that's a good, to that's me? a good joke. Oh, man. Let's go to the car. Maybe he's talking to an imaginary camera. <laughs> I don't know. Wait. Now how do I open this thing? Oh. <laughs> Are you serious? Sir, it's unlocked. Oh. <laughs> I didn't see the button right here. Silly me. Buddy, what's your name? Uh, I'm Cody. I'm your driver. Hi, Cody. I'm Charlie. <laughs> Where is that laughing coming from? Oh, those are my friends. I have schizophrenia. <laughs> oh, okay. That's good to know. Well, uh, listen, Charlie, I'm taking you to the Funny Awards. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty cool. I have heard I'm a funny guy. <laughs> y yeah, so, oh, uh, actually, you know what? I forgot my wallet at home, so I'm going to go run and grab that real quick. You just stay in the car. Okay, I'll be right here. Uh, sorry, I have to turn the car off. Uh, it's gonna get hot in here. Uh, well, I'm sorry, but I have to save gas. Mmm, I understand. Gas prices have gone up. Yeah, yeah, they have. <laughs> okay, Junior, he's in the car, and I'm making my way to the bushes. When is Chef PB coming to, you know, do it? Uh, he said he's on his way right now. Okay, good. That's a nice Hellcat. We in the day, so we gotta get this fool named Charlie. He's in a car that says Jeffy on the side of it, but he about to be a stain on the pavement. Stain on the pavement. Wait, wait. Does that car say Jeffy on the side of it? Pull up, pull up. Oh no, no, that's not. No, that's not it. That's not it. We do say Jeffy on the side of it. Oh, that's our target. Nutty night. Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. What? Wait, wait. Junior's calling me. What? Hello, Junior. What? What do you want? Uh, is Charlie dead? <laughs> I clipped that fool. <laughs> so he's dead? Yes, I unloaded multiple rounds. They got the wrong guy. <laughs> okay, oh my baby. gosh. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, I clipped that fool. What? I shot that hole. <laughs> uh, you, you, you got the wrong guy. Hello? You got the wrong okay, guy. He said he just did it. What? He just said he said he clipped that fool. Well, he must have clipped a different fool because it didn't happen here. Cody, go check on Charlie. He got shot. He did not get shot. I was standing here the whole time. Chef PP said you have unloaded multiple rounds. Maybe you weren't paying attention. I would have noticed if somebody shot him while I was standing here. Maybe Chef PP was using a silencer. He wasn't using a silencer. He wasn't here at all. Cody, go check on Charlie. <sighs> okay, fine. <gasps> oh, God. It's so hot Is he not breathing? I must. Bro, what are you doing? Hey guys, and I'm Charlie, and I'm dying from heat stroke. Help! Get me in the house! How does this work? Okay, Junior, I'm looking at Charlie, and he's very much alive. Are you sure he's alive? Yes, I'm sure. He's looking right at me. Help me. Wait, what's that noise? It's him screaming, help me. Wait, is he saying help me because he got shot? No, there are no bullet holes on the car. Wait, what's he doing now? Wait, hold on. I think he's dead. From all the gunshots? No, no, let me check. But, uh, oh. Charlie, 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 buddy. He can't oh, breathe. God, Junior, I think he's dead. From all the gunshots? No, I think he died of heat stroke because I left him in a hot car. You didn't leave the car on? No, Jeffy said not to waste his gas. Wow, Cody, you just killed Charlie. How do you feel? Well, isn't that what we wanted? Wait, that is what we wanted. Now we can sell the car for millions of dollars. Wait, but who did Chef PB shoot? That's not our problem. Look, call the cops and tell them that you found Charlie dead in the car and we'll get paid. Okay. 
Hey, sir, you called about a dead body? Oh, yeah, it's Charlie from the famous TV show, Charlie and Friends. Oh, my God, he died? Yeah. Oh, it's okay, Simmons, you can look. There's no blood. Oh, thank God. So what happened? Well, I'm his driver, and I just left the car off while I went inside to use the bathroom, and he wanted to stay in the car, and I told him that was a bad idea, but he just wouldn't listen, so I guess he died of a heat stroke. Oh, that's terrible. And I guess I have to just believe you, because, I mean, there's no way you can get locked inside a car. He could have easily gotten out. Yeah, so whose car is this? Oh, it's mine. Oh, that's okay. You can keep the car. We just need the body. You know, there's no need to investigate this further. Oh, that's great. Thanks. Okay, Junior, the terrible deed is done. So we can go sell that car for millions of dollars? I just hope the money's worth it. Oh, the money's gonna be worth it, Cody. When you smell a million dollars under that big, fat nose of yours, you're gonna think it's worth it. Bro. What do we do now? Okay, well, before we sell the car, let's go watch the news and make sure he's dead. <laughs> Wait, why does this dip taste like wiener? Wiener, you say? Come on, Dad, we gotta turn on the news. Chill, what Cody. Charlie? It's very important. <laughs> Charlie, from the hit show Charlie and Friends, has died from an accidental heat stroke in someone's car. He was 28 years old. <laughs> no, not Charlie! My Let's go sell the car, Cody. <laughs> Junior, look! The other news! The other news? <laughs> what? More breaking news! Jeffy the Friendly Landscaper was brutally mowed down by a oh, random drive That was Chef Pee Pee. The killer was caught down the road celebrating. Here's a picture of his mugshot. He goes by the name of Chef Penis. We also oh. have exclusive footage from the arrest, and we will show you that now. Sir, sir, did you just shoot the man in the car over there? Yeah, I shot that hole. I bodied his ass. He's six feet deep, you feel me? Gun in a car and all. You can have Bro. it. What? Wow, you made that really easy for me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're welcome. Oh, no. Wait, Cody, how did Chef Pee get the wrong car? I don't know. What address did you text him? Uh, let me check. Oh, no, Junior, I sent him the wrong address number. So you got Chef Pee arrested? No, he got himself arrested because he did a drive-by. Okay, now we have to bail him out of jail. How much is his bail? Uh, let me look it up. Uh, ten million dollars. I'm surprised he even has any. So now we have to sell the car for at least twenty million to be able to bail him out. Oh, man. Okay, let's go sell the car. Come on, Cody. All right, Cody, we sold the car. Yeah, we got $10,000 for it. But the Kelly Blue Book on that car was only 5000 so we basically robbed that man. He only gave us this so we would go away. We needed $20 million, and two people are dead, and one of our friends is going to prison and probably getting the death penalty. But hey, $10,000, right? Okay, Cody, I'll admit it. This idea was stupid. Yeah, yeah, it is stupid, Junior. I wish you would have told me. I tried so hard. And got so far. But in the end, it didn't even matter. Cause yep. Every time, Junior comes up with an idea. Sometimes Cody wants to convince him to not do that. It backfired. How many times have he have, has Junior done this? Mostly a lot. Every time. Some ideas worked, some idea didn't work. A lot of them didn't work. Maybe you should leave some ideas to Cody. Because if you're just going to bully him, Cody, just walk out. Do your idea. Don't be a part of Junior's idea. Because he is stupid. Two people are dead. Well, look, it's not too late to fix this. Yes, it is. Oh, no, look, we can go to Chevy B's trial and tell the judge that he didn't mean to shoot that guy. He meant to shoot someone else. It doesn't matter. He still shot someone. <sighs> You already killed it. You want to eat some chips and dip? Yeah, sure. I hear they taste like wiener. Guess we're in court, then. Chef Pee you are being accused of and proudly admitted to shooting a man in cold blood while he was simply sitting in his car. Why? I'm sorry, Judge. I thought I was getting someone famous. Oh, he was famous, all right. He was just known as the nicest old man in our town. He waved at everybody. I'm sorry, Judge. I thought I was killing Charlie. Please have mercy. Oh, don't beg me for mercy. Beg God for mercy on your butthole in prison after I sentence you to life in prison. Wait, 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 wait a minute, Judge. We got the autopsy report back. The old man didn't die from any gunshot wounds. He died of a heart attack. I mean, probably because he was scared because of the gunshots. But still, Chef Pee didn't kill anybody. Well, this changes everything. The law says if the bullets did not hit, you must acquit. So, Chef Pee I sentence you to freedom. Just don't go around shooting guns at people anymore. Especially not the elderly. You're going to let off a, a wanted murderer? <laughs> Whatever. Because they can't hold a real one back. 
know really how. Wow. <laughs> it was never him. He must have got scared and had a heart attack or something. I still feel like you caused that. Nah, he had to be old, like 97 or something. Ooh, chills. Mm. Wait, why does it taste like pee, pee Oh, I stuck my pee, -pee in there. What, really? <laughs> Where's my car? Oh, they forgot about it. Oh, no. I guess Jeffy's gonna beat them up now. Since, um, they forgot about the car. I don't know if they done some damage to it. <laughs> but anyways, guys, if we do make it to the end of this video, I really, really appreciate it. Don't, don't get into Junior's idea. That's what I'm, that's all I'm gonna say. Jeez. Sometimes, I don't know if Junior, like annoys you too much because of his idea being stupid so he could literally just it literally fails at the end i don't know <laughs> so yeah if you guys enjoy make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel here and i'll see you guys in the next video i'm out <laughs>